everyone, good morning and welcome back to another vlog. So I'm actually up pretty early, I say this every morning, but today is actually a really exciting day for me. Today is my first driving lesson, I have it at 11 o'clock and it's currently a half past 10, so I'm kind of nervous, I don't know, like obviously I've only driven my mum's car, if you guys saw that vlog then, if not I'll link it on screen, but oh my god, I was so scared. Obviously the first lesson doesn't really entail obviously driving on the roads, it's more just like talking and stuff, but I'm really exciting. I'm doing my driving lessons with Red, so I've heard they're really, really good. So I'm really, I don't know, I'm so excited, but I'm so nervous. Of course, I'm gonna let you guys know what I think of it. I've got a two hour lesson today, 11 until one, so. Oh my god. And then after that I'm actually helping somebody out for their photography work and we're doing a photo shoot so I'm also going to get some new photos and stuff to post on Instagram which is really exciting and then I think I'm going to film a video with mum and I think we're just going to kind of maybe do a bit of shopping and go out for dinner and stuff as on a Monday me and my mum always kind of spend a bit of time together. But yeah that is basically my plan for today. I will let you guys know what I think about my driving lesson. I don't really know how often I'm going to be able to do them probably like once a week because everybody was like do a crash course but I don't really want to do a crash course I want to do it like weekly or like do it like over time if that makes sense but I also do need to book my theory test so that's going to be interesting. I am just about to go on my driving lesson he's literally going to pull up like any minute so I basically changed my top because I thought it would be more comfy to kind of do it in this I've just popped my coat on just going to get my shoes on and yeah that is basically it where are my shoes okay I'm going to wear trainers love this angle and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm so nervous. I know I've said it so many times and like there's nothing to be nervous for, but I just don't think I'm gonna be a very good driver. That's all. But yeah, that's what I'm doing now. So I will let you guys know how it went. And yeah, oh my God. Guys, I am home from my first driving lesson and it actually went so well. I did a two hour lesson. So obviously like I was just kind of like, learning to pick up everything and like all the gears and everything like that so it was really good i really enjoyed myself like getting used to the car was obviously really nerve-wracking because apart from mum's little driving lesson that was the first time i'd ever driven a car so it was really nerve-wracking but we basically like drove up we went to like a really quiet area and he was teaching me like all the different stuff and then I basically drove up the road like testing out the speed and stuff it was really fun though like it's really weird being in control of the car because obviously that was my first ever time so it's really weird but I really enjoy myself I've got another lesson next week so I think pardon me we're probably going to do like one every week so that's really exciting but yeah I really enjoyed it I'm learning with red if you guys wanted to know they're really good really lovely and I definitely recommend them and yeah I'm actually I don't know it's so weird I'm so excited though. I loved it. I actually genuinely loved it. I am now off for a mini photo shoot. So I'm helping one of my friends out with her photography a, like course. She's in year 13. Her name's Rianne. So I'm just going to go to like a local park area and she's going to take some photos for me, which I'm really excited about because I need some new photos as well. So as well as helping her out, she's helping me out, which is really, really nice. So I'm really excited for that. And then me and my mum are going to film a video, which I'm really excited for. I think you guys are going to love this video. So so keep your eyes out for that. It'll either be out Wednesday or Sunday, but most probably Wednesday. So I'm really excited for it. I'm now home from my photo shoot. It went so well. I didn't film any of it because all the pictures are going to be on my Instagram. I should be getting sent them tonight. So I'll show you guys all the photos. But I'm home. Mum's home now. And we're just having like a chat about the colour of the sky. Everybody is talking about it on Twitter. And it's so weird. Everybody's saying it's because there's a storm on the way. Because, um... Obviously, there's been a storm in Ireland this morning, and I think, how many people did you say have died? Two people. Two people have died, and it's literally <coughs> heartbreaking. So, everybody's saying, yeah, it's like the sand from the Sahara Desert, or something like that. Uh, that's not, everybody's, everybody's tweeting me saying it's the sand from the Sahara Desert, so I'm not really sure, but I'm really, like, I won't pick up on camera, though, that's the thing, but, like, I'm pretty sure all of you guys... On the camera, Anna? I'm pretty sure all of you guys would have seen it, because, you know, like, you would have seen the sky. But it's so, so it's weird, like and like, orange, it's like glowing orange, and like, my eyes really hurt when I look outside, so it's so weird, but, um, yeah, it's really odd. Also, I just want to quickly correct myself, it wasn't the moon I saw, it was the sun. I was sure it was the moon, because it looked like the moon, it was tiny, I've never seen it that small before. <laughs> but everybody's tweeting, and like, I'm just watching some videos now, and it is actually the sun, and it's because of like, the Sahara Desert and stuff, so... It's so, so odd. Let me see if I can show you guys. My camera has actually picked it up. Yeah, to a point. Yeah, yeah look, mum, yeah, look at that. Has, yeah. You can oh, actually yeah, see yeah. what it's like now. How weird God. is this? 
so this is as much as I can get of the sun on camera because I don't want to damage my lens I'm scared it will damage it but how crazy is that so me and mum are now in the car we're actually filming a video for this Wednesday this Wednesday at 6 p.m you are going to want to be on my channel honestly it's probably going to be one of my favorite ever videos and one of the best videos we've ever done so please 6 p.m you guys are going to be so excited are you excited mum I am so excited this is like so mum's excited. proper excited mum's more excited than I am probably I am. Me and mum just finished filming. It is such a good video. So I really hope you guys are there on Wednesday at 6 p.m. to check it out. Now we're gonna go for some food. Mum said she fancies a KFC. She never. No, I said, said I fancy fancies. the rice box. That's a KFC. Yeah, but not, yeah. <laughs> mum never found the barbecue KFC, so I was like yeah you know what we'll take up the chance and we'll go to KFC so that's exactly where we're going now I'm very excited and then we're gonna get head over to Primark but yeah that video was so good how do you find it mum without giving away what it is yeah it was good yeah it was good I, I was really excited I won't give anything away. I was really excited to do it probably the most exciting one I've done for Anna so far um but after doing it it's changed our outlook right now I feel, things. I feel really deflated and only because you had your hopes up but anyway that's giving away too much so i don't want to yeah want, okay I don't want okay but wednesday 6 p.m okay. be there here we go here is my go-to kfc order it's basically just a mega box gravy and a coke and then mum what did you get i've got a rice box these Go are on, gorgeous then. These are your favourite things, aren't they? That, to be fair, it looks really nice. Chips the... and barbecue beans. Oh, that's the rice. Yeah. To be fair, it looks it's really, really nice. good. It does I think really it's really a tiny nice. expensive. How much is it? Only really five pound. Uh, mm, it's not too bad. But it's really nice. That looks really good. So excited to eat this, aren't you, Mum? We have now come to Russian Lake, and I think you guys can see behind me. The sun is actually still bright orange, like bright orange. And it literally, I looked at it and blinked and now my eyes are killing. But I think I just said we we're at Reston Lakes. Yeah, we're at Reston Lakes and I'm on my way to Primark. Here it is. So excited for this. I really wanted to do another Primark haul for you guys. So yeah, we've come to Primark. Mummy, excited to go to Primark? Yeah. That's so excited. I love these, this, for the living room. Yeah, that is nice. Look, just imagine snuggled up in that, Anna. Oh my God. You're such an idiot. It's so not a, nice. It's not a it. cape, Mum. It's a blanket. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's really nice, Anna. <laughs> what else? <laughs> I like this one too. Look, that's different. That is different. I like that. I like all of them, to be fair. To be honest, if we had a blue, I really like this cushion. But obviously, my finger's that's not blue. Really nice, but I really like Anna. that. Yeah, I know. It's, I know it's really nice. I need an autumnal bed cover. Bed spread. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? This is nice. Yeah, that's nice. Feel for four pounds. That is very nice. <laughs> <laughs> Can't tell if this is Anna hint behind me blanket or <laughs> now viewers, what do you think? Is Anna gonna purchase this? <laughs> Keep her mum warm in winter. You've got like four blankets on the sofa already. <laughs> no, this is joking aside, feel it. <laughs> it joking feels, aside, feel it. It Anna. feels like every other Primark blanket no, that we have uh, on the sofa. It's a bit softer, a bit softer. No, it's not. It is. No, it's They've not. Improved. And how many cushions have we got on the sofa? There's a point we can't sit on the sofa. I do have an obsession with cushions, to be fair. Hey, why not? I'll buy you this one. That's disgusting. <laughs> I really like that one in the different room, Anna. The living room's not blue, it's yellow. <laughs> it's not yellow, where are you getting that from? Yellow and black are living room colour is. Yeah, you'd have a pop of colour. A pop of colour? Really? I really can't tell if you're being serious. I like that and I like that. Which one are you buying me, Anna? don't know I'm not really any because you've got four blankets on the sofa already so I've met Casey in Primark and she said she watches my vlog so I wanted to put her in the vlog thank you so much <laughs> when we get home I'm where's the logic in that where's I'm the fairness in that? when we get home it's not a competition you when tell we me. get home I buy let's you talk lot. about that let's I, talk about I that I bought you a life course bag the other week she did to be fair yeah exactly she and did guess what I bought you <laughs> yeah but they take the place of um a big pair of warm arms don't they do you know what I mean 
which to be fair I haven't had for a very long time. So I do have an obsession with cushions, blankets, mugs, candles, um, and they make me happy, as does the occasional cigarette, um, as does buying tops and clothes. It all makes me happy. Yeah, well, there you go. As soon as I get home, I'm going to show you guys our blanket collection, our mug collection. And it's a bloody How nice blanket the collection fact, as no, well. No, no, the fact that we can't sit on our, cush our sofa because there's too many cushions, you have to sit on the cushions. And wouldn't this finish it off nicely? We could all huddle in that together, all three of us, Anna. Me, well, you no, and your brother. Atticus won't sit still and he'll tell me to move up the Cozy way. Cozy winter, me, no, you and your brother, no, no, wrapped no, no, in that. No, 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 Atticus won't sit still and then he'll tell me to move up the <laughs> way and then Atticus will go, Anna, you can't talk to mummy. It's my turn to talk to mummy. Can we just show him this thigh though? Because this is, um, I mean, yeah, this can. is different, look. It's really nice. No, it is though, isn't it? It's different, Anna, you must admit. It's... Yeah, it's different. I think that's a bit much for £9 though. No, it's because they're big ones, look, luxury. Right, They're not your cheapo four pound ones, they're your luxury ones, Anna. I'll buy you a four pound one. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Last of the because, big spenders here. Because <laughs> you don't need another blanket. Yeah, let's see how big the four pound one is, yeah. Let's let's see. That'll probably cover a thigh. I swear, half That'll the probably cover me thigh. <laughs> no, half the time it's actually role reversal between me and Mum. Yeah, if you say so, Anna. But your view is no otherwise. Shut up. Why are you doing the whole blanket? Because I'm seeing how big it is, Anna. Oh my god, it matches your outfit at least. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, my granny card again. She told me I had to <laughs> <I'm> in the <laughs> car. <laughs> you folded it on, that's alright. Covers your thigh, it covers your whole body. And half the time I come down to her, you're not even in a blanket, you're in a robe <laughs> because you can't even bother to put the blanket on. Because you get annoyed if it's not folded. No, to be fair, I like the navy. Yeah. Great. Like yeah, you can tell because you're wearing navy jeans, navy top, and a navy cardigan. Mm. My top's black, Anna. Oh, right, sorry, it looks navy. You happy with your £4 blanket? Mm, you don't seem very happy. I am, it'll keep me warm. What, along with your other four blankets? Yeah. When I can't afford to have you eating on. <laughs> Mum! <laughs> <laughs> when I'm in that B&B. <laughs> <laughs> You'll have to make it into a copper themed bean <laughs> Look at all the tic tacs. Go <laughs> down there as well. Yeah. <laughs> Mum, pose with the tic tacs for my thumbnail. What? Pose with the tic tacs for my thumbnail. We are home from Primark. I hope you guys enjoyed mine and Mum's little Primark adventures. Mum, did you enjoy our Primark adventures? Yeah. I'm sure you did, telling everybody, oh, I said you didn't buy me anything. <laughs> when you goddamn well know what I do. I don't know what we're going to do now. Atticus is still out, so he is not going to be coming home for like 45 minutes. So, what are you going to do? I'm going to have to rest. I am shattered. I haven't stopped all day since 5 o'clock this morning. So I'm going to have a little rest. You're going to light tea light? I'm going to light my candles because that's what I do. That's what I do. The lighting down here is just awful. Well, it's, not, it's, a, it's not, it's a vintage oh. bulb. It's because that's a vintage bulb. Oh, that's why. Oh, it's so much better in here, yeah. Oh, okay. I don't really know what I'm going to do tonight. I don't really know, to be honest. It's quite a bit later now. I am now upstairs. I've finished filming my video with mum. I've finished basically doing everything. So now I can finally chill. I just got a glass of Coke. I never normally drink Coke unless it's at dinner time. Like, or unless I'm having it with food. I'm um, having it with people. Like, I just never have glasses of Coke. So there's a new one. And I've also got myself a croissant to eat. Because I really fancied one. But yeah, that's basically what I'm doing right now. I have quite a lot to do tomorrow as well. It's kind of my last day off for a few days. Not really day off either because I'm working again. But I'm now going to sit here and watch the episode of the Vampire Diaries. I am on the last episode of series four. Episode 22. I'm pretty sure that's the last episode. Although I'm just going to quickly check before I say that. But it's so good. Like... So many people have been like, Anna, you've got me hooked to the Vampire Diaries. Oh no, there's episode 23. Okay, so I'm nearly at the end of season four. It's honestly amazing. Everybody's saying to me, you've got me hooked. So definitely watch it. Please comment down below who's your favourite. Mine's still Stefan, looks wise, but then I love Damon looks wise. Oh, I can't choose, I can't choose. It is basically like one o'clock in the morning. So I'm going to end tonight's vlog here. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, remember to give it a huge thumbs up. And I will see you tomorrow at 6pm for a brand new vlog. Mwah.